DTCers, how's it going? It's tickling me in scaff, my friends. Um, Porter's here, DTC product review time. Just a quickie, you know my mate Kev the Mentalist, Kevin the Mentalist, he's compiling a, a new book. He, uh, I wouldn't have thought it would make a DVD, to be honest with you. And it's, uh, it's titled, this is the rough version here, 101, 101 words I didn't use until I got into magic and mentalism. It's a fascinating, it's a fascinating read. It's alongside the 101 Great Goals and 101 Great Tries, that series of bids that was about years ago. Just a quick look. Let's just pay pay 16 here. Coalesce. There's one. Coalesce. Another one. Inertia. He's got a little, little sides. Better when said by an American. Must have seen it on one of the, um, the American Magic DVDs. But I love this. This at the end. Number one. This is this is number one. He's ranked them in order of one to hundred. Number one, Darren. <laughs> and, and in brackets, I did have an uncle Darren before, but I never heard of the word Darren. Or the name Darren he's put underneath there. Um, there's all sorts. Uh, number number seventy four, billet. All that in bracket, uh, uh, unless you count uh, the French GCSE French, <laughs> which I think is ticket, isn't it? Um, anyway, look out for that when it comes out. I've been looking at. Got it. Callan Morelli, transit. And um, this basically is a 23 minutes long DVD, street performances, detailed explanation. I quite like this thing under here, it just explains it. Instructional DVD, 23 minutes, street performances, detailed explanation. It's all on the box. It's quite nice. You know what you're getting into. Do you like rubber band magic? That's a question. I don't. Not I don't. Well, I just don't do it. Maybe I'm rubbish at it, but I, I, it's not for me. So straight away, this isn't particularly for me. If you do like rubber band magic, I think you might get a lot of kicks out of this. I think quite might quite enjoy it. Um, basically, the effect is you got got a rubber band, and it can go from one finger to the other to the other one, and ends up on the thumb. I think it is. Um, and to be honest with you, it reminds me of a. Uh, a more organic version, if you think a uh, rubber band is more organic than a ring, than um, the uh, the latest one that came out, the, the ring thing, not the ring thing, but the, what was it, I did a review on it, I can't, I can't remember it, where the ring goes from one thing to the other to the other. It's like that, but with a rubber band, basically. Um, one, this is my, God, I, I'm sorry, there's an issue here. On the back, it says a normal rubber band is secured on your finger. The rubber band is ungimmicked, and can even be borrowed. Well, I would hazard a guess that of all the magic gigs I've ever done, if I've asked someone if they've got a rubber band I can borrow, exactly the same colour as the one on here, I could live to 145, or the maximum, 147, um, and still not have anyone. I mean, this could be a rubber band from a distance, could it? This, this blue one? I mean, Anyway, and and then and then there is a gimmick involved. So that I just a little bit misleading. I, I don't want that misleading thing really on the back. Um, or maybe this is just how it's seen by the spectator. But um, I, I, you know, that that's a slight issue for me. But what you know, it's all very well explained. And and let's be honest, this Callum Morelli, the Bieber of the magic world, good-looking, talented, young. Uh, he's got he's got everything everything going for him. And ugh, great thoughts. Where did he get these thoughts from? Well, I'm sure when I was his age, I was thinking of beer and women. 
uh, you like fast cars, Mr. Bond. Anyway, um, that, uh, but it's, it's well explained. I'm not, I've not tried it because it wasn't of interest to me, but I've had a little sort of talk with a few other people and they say a little bit of effort with, you know, getting the rhythm right, a couple of knacky modes, but generally it's not too difficult. It takes a bit of time to get it slick. Um, so if it's your kind of thing, if you, if you do use rubber band stuff and then you can go into this, then great, it's another thing to add to the rubber band thing. For me, again, um, I would, if I was going to do it, I'd think, how can I make it really connect with the audience? And I think um, old uh, Morelli Meister here said, so at the start, it, it, can, it can wow and wonder and, and give love. I'm not sure it can give love, to be honest with you. Um, I think it would, it would give wonder. I mean, people go, oh my God, look at that, that's kind of cool. But I, I, I think if I was going to do this, I, I don't know if I could find it easy to can make it connect with, with an audience, make them feel special about it. It's, I suppose it's just more the magician being kind of kind of clever. But um, as I said, it does, look, it does look good if you like that sort of thing. If you use rubber band man, uh, stuff, I think you'll like it a lot. Uh, he's very talented, and, um, but uh, just a little bit misleading on the back. So all in all, my friends, I'm going to say that this is a solid buy, if you like your rubber band magic, for both the worker, be good uh, angles wise, it's pretty okay with the worker. Uh, hobbyist, it would be great, you know. And um, yeah, so I'm going to give it four styles all round. Not my cup of tea, but then I don't even drink tea. So um, there you go. All the best and enjoy yourself. Why not? Do you like that? I bought it for the winter and it's now summer. Still like it though. All the best, again. Thank you for watching DTC MTV Product Review.